Hey guys, I'm back with another process video and this is Young Victoria and my Glamour Shot. <laughs> if you guys recall, do you guys remember Glamour Shots? Have you ever had Glamour Shots taken? Post below in the comment section if you had a Glamour Shot taken. So Glamour Shots, for those who aren't familiar, or photo studios that you can typically find in malls. And what they do is you are assigned a makeup artist or hair artist or whatever, and they do this makeup um, this makeover so that you get makeup done you get your hair done and you get photos taken in various different frocks so for me um, I got my nice big bouffant of hair that's like shellacked with Aquanet as well as that hideous blue jean jacket that's all bedazzled <laughs> so bad so bad so anyway um, my best friend and I wanted these pictures taken and um, begged our parents for weeks if we could have glamour shots and so finally they relented um, they paid for us to have the glamour shots. My mom took us and it was like a two hour ordeal of getting your hair done and the whole nine. I took the photos, was so anxious to see the photos. When we got to preview them, I hated them. I hated my photos. I thought it was hideous and I was so upset. And my mom, as I'm, you know, pounding with all of, you know, every bit of teenage angst was like, what the hell? I just paid $150 for you to take these photos and you don't like them. You're, you better like these damn photos. You know? So she's going off <laughs> on me with these crazy little photos. And so anyway, looking back on it now, I think I look adorable. <laughs> but that big hair and those big earrings. <laughs> oh, good times. Good times indeed. Okay, so I'm doing this 6 by 12 layout because I want to keep it simple and focused on the story. And I don't have to do a whole bunch of embellishing because that photo says it all. And that bedazzled jacket says it all too. So I'm grabbing some pieces from my Felicity Jane October kit. That's what I'm using for this layout. I don't know if I mentioned that earlier. And there's some wood veneer pieces that come with this kit. Now the title that says Fabulous, that Thickers font, um, that's actually from a different kit. That's not from a um, Felicity Jane kit. So I'm positioning all those things. I just want to do a couple of clusters there at the top and the bottom of the journaling. And I decide I am going to heat emboss some of these, not some of them, but all three of my wood veneer pieces. I need a new Versamark pad. <laughs> I decided to get distress ink on that Versamark pad, so it's time for a new one. Anywho, so I go ahead and sprinkle some enamel, not enamel, but some embossing powder on those wood veneers and heat those with my heat gun to melt that powder. And now it's time to position everything. Now, while um, I was letting those pieces kind of dry just a little bit and cool down, I went and typed up the journaling, which basically says everything that I talked about, you know, um, it being the 90s, I was probably about 13, went to glamour shots, um, didn't like my photo. My mom said I was being dramatic because I was. <laughs> now I'm putting on the sticker that says these moments, that's exclusive to the kit. And then um, another sticker, which I don't know why I put adhesive on that because it's a sticker. <laughs> But either way, it's down. And then, oh, I do the same thing with that sticker too. I didn't even realize that. Okay, so I put those two circles there, one at the top, one at the bottom. And now I'm going to layer on my wood veneer pieces, these little cute hearts. And yes, here we go. So here I'm using some um, Tombow Mono Aqua Glue. Get those all put down. And lately I've really been into simple scrapbooking. And I don't know what it is. I kind of go through phases where I like super embellished layouts and then I need something super clean. And I like the six by 12 layout because it provides just enough room for embellishing, but it also forces me to focus on the story, which I'm intentionally doing a lot more of these days. I went back and looked at some of my layouts and I noticed that I wasn't scrapping the story in a very robust way. And so, or my stories in a very robust way. So I want to change it up a bit. Alrighty, so now I'm using some Nouveau Drops. And these are gold Nouveau, nouveau drop, <laughs> say that fast 10 times. And I just wanna add a couple of little dots or maybe three dots there at the top just for some interest and add it sparkle. And then I'm gonna add a couple here at the bottom cluster. And these dry um, raised and they kinda of look like enamel dots. All right, so here we go. The finished product of this beautiful layout. <laughs> of a picture that I hated as a teenager, but I eventually grew to love. Some photos are coming up. Check out the Victoria Marie blog for more information about this layout and others, as well as classes that I have that are offered right now. If you are so interested, thanks so much for stopping by.